Hey everyone, welcome back. In this video, we are going to discuss about how to manage the price list based on country groups. To manage with this, let's move on to the sales module. Uh, and under the configuration settings, we can manage with the price list. So there we can find two types of price list, which is uh, the multiple prices per product as well as advanced price rules. So once we have enabled this feature from the configuration settings, we can save the changes and we can just move on to the product menu where we can manage with the price list. So we know Odo is a large community and it has got customers from different country. So in such cases, the company might be running uh, in different currency uh, let's say the company is running in usd but the customers need to get the currencies or the price list based on their country so in such cases we can generate the price list based on country group here let's say we have customers from india as well as from china and we will be generating the price list based on indian price list as well as based on the uh, chinese price list so here i have already created the indian price list and chinese price list where you can just provide the name of the price list and you can give the currency over here so in india we know it's uh, inr as a currency and we need to apply this for all the products so you can just keep this uh, pricing rules as empty so that every uh, product can be applied this pricing rules now um, you know under the configuration tab we have a field called country groups currently we need to apply this uh, price list for indian customers so you can just choose indian as the country group over here as like you can also create uh, the price list for china and you can give the currency that is used in china and we will be restricting this for a particular country which is china now let's move on uh, to the uh, sales module like we were in the sales module itself so you can choose the customers over here so we can see the customers from india as well as from china and let's move on to the uh, customer rama devi who is an indian customer so we need to ensure that we have applied the right price list for the customer rema so let's move on to the sales and purchase tab where you can find that uh, the price list is set as indian customer so this customer will be getting uh, the price based on her currency and here you can also find a customer uh, who is decorated uh, yeah he's from china and here we need to ensure that uh, he has got the right price list so if not correctly configured uh, just configured it from here and you can choose the chinese price list and let's save this now let's move on to the orders and let's choose the quotation and click on new button to create the quotations so here you can choose the customer rema so as you choose the customer rema you can see that order will automatically configure the price list over here so as we choose the price i mean product uh, over here you can find that the price will be translated or converted to the indian price list over here now let's create another uh, yeah quotation for the customer uh, who is uh, from china that is deco addict so as we choose a customer deco addict you can see the price list is automatically configured here and you can see that as we just choose a product the price will be just converted to the um, chinese price list and you can find the price over here so this is how we manage with the price list based on con country groups so hope this video clarifies your doubt on how to manage the price list based on country groups so if you want to uh, know more about odoo or you need odoo customization feel free to contact team cybrosis thank you for watching the video have a nice day